So almost one year ago, actually in January of this year, January 3rd to be exact, I decided to buy $1,500 worth of Tesla stock. And in today's video, you guys are gonna see how much money I made or how much money I lost with this investment. So I hope you guys all enjoy this video. If you guys get anything in value out of it, hit that like button, subscribe. If you guys are new to the channel, this is your first video, welcome. Welcome, we talk about everything money, stocks, money management, trading, investing, so subscribe. Join the team, do it right now. Subscribe and like, do it right now. All right, let's jump into how much money I made. All right, so before we jump into the exact dollar amount, let's put things in perspective. I invested not 1,500, actually $1,405, equivalent at the time to about 13 shares. The purchase price was near and around $108. Now the reason why I wanted to buy it is I've been buying Tesla for years, but I really wanted to load up on some shares. Before then I used other brokers and I mostly just dollar cost averaged. I really thought Tesla near and around $100 was an absolute bargain. The company was bringing in so much money, increasing revenues, profit margins, and all that stuff. So I decided to invest a little bit of some money into it. Not even realizing that one of the best sectors to invest in is technology, AI, and with that being said, Tesla is heavily invested into both. So obviously this investment grew. All right, so my $1,405.30 that I invested grew to $3,307.98. That is a total return of $1,902.68 or near and around 135.39. So obviously this investment outperformed the S&P, the Dow Jones, the NASDAQ. So looking forward, am I selling my shares? Absolutely not. For me, Tesla is an absolute bargain of a deal at its current price. The strategy that I am doing and the strategy that I would recommend isn't dumping thousands of dollars all up front into Tesla. I believe the best strategy going forward into Tesla is going to be dollar cost averaging. Dollar cost averaging is a way to invest in the growth stocks, stocks that are a little more risky, stocks that are a little more volatile, but dollar cost averaging, what you do is instead of dumping money all up front, you just invest consistently. So instead of dumping money in all up front, what you do is maybe you invest every single week or every other week, or some people will do it monthly. But for me, I would rather invest weekly. The beautiful thing about investing super consistently is if Tesla stock sells off, that works better for me because I'm buying those dips. So as Tesla sells off more and more and more, I'm buying those lows. Then once the stock recovers, I make a lot more money because my average cost is so low because I've been buying those dips. Now compared to if you dumped a whole bunch of money all up front to Tesla, you could be buying in overvalued or all time highs. So what happens is, is if Tesla stock starts selling off, then you don't have any funds to buy those dips. Dollar cost averaging, in my opinion, is by far the best investment strategy for going forward into Tesla, just because it still carries so much potential. It still has great revenues, great profit margins, and yes, we've seen some slowdowns, but what sector has it? We're seeing high inflation, we're seeing high interest rates, and those two things alone are gonna put a car manufacturer you know, on the line. Is Tesla gonna go under business? No, they're not. They have a ton of money saved. They're not going anywhere. And I honestly believe looking back in two to five, 10 years, we're gonna be wishing we would have bought Tesla at its current prices today. So guys, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. If you guys did, hit that like button, subscribe, and we'll see you guys tomorrow in another episode. Guys, and go check out Moomoo. Moo. They are probably the best broker. I'll put it down below so you guys can check them out, but we'll see you guys later. Hit that like button, subscribe, and we'll see you guys tomorrow.